Hi, my name is David Walker, and this is my Catherine Dunham documentary. Catherine Dunham was an African-American dancer, and she believed that segregation was bad. And she helped by making sure that places that she performed in, that black people were allowed to sit there. She would do a performance once, and if black people weren't allowed to sit in there, she wouldn't do it again until they were allowed to sit there. The side effect of this was that she was discriminated, yelled at, called not nice words, and people probably did bad actions towards her. Even though this happened, she stood strong to help end segregation. You've heard about it, the occasion when I was in Lexington, Kentucky, and uh, the audience was totally segregated. I did not, foolishly, I didn't think about it because I was so busy with the company and that has saved me so many, many times. I was just, just too busy to, to get into what I considered the small things. It turned out to be a big thing. It turned out that no black people could sit in the uh, orchestra seats. And I, after going through a whole lot of, a whole lot, of resistance, threats, you name it. I did everything possible to be able to get on that stage and feel good about it, and I couldn't. I couldn't win then. Therefore, I decided if I couldn't win at the beginning, I'd win at the end. <laughs> Catherine Dunham was born June 22nd, 1909, and died May 21st, 2006. When she was little, she would dance for her church in Juliet. Around, at around age eight, she would dance for the multiple elders in the area, and they were very amused. At one point in time, her church was low on money, so she danced for money. Uh, to help keep the church going. And originally, her family wanted her to be a teacher, and they also wanted her to go to University of Chicago for a master's degree. But when they found out that she was going to be a dancer, they did not approve of it at first. But later, they got used to it. They say that in the 1930s, she revolutionized dancing by going in the black root dances and, and old rituals as well. People tried to recreate some of her dances and were successful. Before I go, I would like to show you one of her dances before she died. And now, the best part, the bloopers. But when she was little, she would sing at a church in Juliet. And she would dance for, oh, I, shh, nah, come on, I don't have my notes open. The side effect of this was that she was discriminated, called bad names, and, oh God, ah! driving me crazy. But despite this, she kept strong and stayed in the fight for... The side effect of this was that she was discriminated. Discriminated. Real quick, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. And if you have anything that you want me to improve or change, please tell me. I would love your feedback.